And hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Ohana Hobby Workshop, joined by myself, Mango Smasher, and today we are doing the Storm in the Shire campaign with Rob. So uh, this will be Riftwatch Orcs versus Halflings. Um obviously we're using TTS for this because we don't currently have the models. Um and we're having to bounce around with names again. Um, so I will be using generic orcs for this one and Rob is using dwarfs. So let me do this. Yeah, mission one. Right. Da -da 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 -da. right. Mission one, mission one, still mission one campaign. Okay. Right, so da -da -da. terrain's all done. Uh, so, right, now we need to start deploying stuff then, basically, because everything else is done. You deploy first. I'll walk some orcs. Yep. Cool, I will put... Where's the rulers? So we can... I don't remember which one they're on. Because there's a bag that has a ruler on it. I don't know what that is. Ah, there we are. King's Mortals. Found it. There we go. So I deployed the first one. Yep. So let's go. These guys here. Uh, your turn to do one. Oh, roll a d3. Not. <laughs> oh, <boy. laughs> I just rolled a one. You got to deploy two units. You mean one unit? Because that's d3. Yeah, but it's d3 plus one. Ugh. Scrying jam for the win, people. Such a busted fucking thing. Yeah. Yes, yes, it is. Um, and then I am going to place my character here. Um, uh, you have D three plus one again. Oh. Uh, yep. Same thing again. And then I believe it's my turn now. Have you done the next unit? Oh, you deploy. I've deployed my last one, so that's all five. Because that's two, then a two, then it'd be. Once you deploy your second, I deploy my last. Yeah. So, finished deployment. <laughs> okay. Let's need to check something. Got some bad movement. Let's just check something. Because I need to make sure I've done something like that. Well, be nice to me. Right. Uh, so my next unit is going to be these guys that are going to go here. Have you deployed it? Your last one, yeah? Yeah. Cool. <sighs> so let's deploy my last two blocks. Um, and. Before the turn starts, I'm going to use the Visions of the Rift 2 ability uh, <laughs> from my Thunder Series. That allows me to. Um, let me go and check the wall quickly. It doesn't bloody tell me where it is. Uh, it basically allows me to redeploy them. So I can redeploy these. There we go, and that's a free move they get. So I get a first turn because orcs are orcs are mean. So da -da -da. So put that there because that's got my rules on. So everyone has a move of five. 
So these guys are going to move up. Actually, I'm going to... What's... A move of a uh, halfling swap four, or is it five? Five. Uh, it's five, yeah. Thank you. I'm gonna double move these, and then I'm gonna do a pivot there. He's gonna go behind the trees, so he will benefit from the trees, and then these guys are gonna go. Double move straight through, but because of difficult terrain, then minus one move. So they only get an eight. These guys are gonna double move as well. They're not going through difficult terrain. And then these guys are gonna move twelve for their double move. And then I think he's good. Yeah, so he's good. So shooting. Um, uh, three, three, four, four. Yep. Can you shoot through the trees? Uh, no, he can't. So yeah, that's my turn. <laughs> Enjoy defense five. Defense five? Yep. Yeah, that's five inches for the harvester, but the harvester can can it move faster? No, um, no, it can't. I will double move him then. Yeah, you can double get move. him into position. Well, this is going to be fun. Yeah. Oh, by, oh, I need to put my guy's name. I forgot to put his name. Okay, he's got his name now. Oh, God damn it! <laughs> I've actually named him out on the war spell. Uh, my half... My halfling uh, rifle troop can see your reborn legionary regiment. Uh, reborn Legionnaires, yeah? Yeah, huh? Mm -hmm. That uh, would be minus one to hit because they are in the trees. Yeah. Just double checking the range. 18 inches, piercing one. You're not going to like this, but they can't hit. Your tanks, in the, arc, your tanks in the arc of fire. Eh. But they can let me do it from so technically, some of them could. Yeah, as long as one thing. Because it's taking from closest to closest. If it was to take from there to th like hit from this edge to that edge, okay. they'd hit. Right, let's do the arts. So I'll do this way. That's basically like that. Yeah, yeah it, do... this thing just doesn't want to stick. Yeah, no, it's fine. Okay. That's shooting through my own guys. Yeah, so you can't do that. And then this one, because of the way the arcs work, you can't even hit them. Because the arc line doesn't go from there, it goes out like how this is. Yeah. And with the way that this one is, the arc line only, you know, just out from that back unit. Can the, uh, can the engineer shoot or no then? Um, I'm not sure. Let me double check how the arcs are meant to look. But I'm... Because... Um, right, okay, so I've got a rough idea now how the arc is. 
So according to this, the art is literally how I put it. So it's like right. that. It's like that, but I would say yes, but I would get a minus one. That's fine. Because the tank, your that one's not all the way in. Um, whereas him, he wouldn't be able to. He would completely miss. So you get at least, at least get these guys to shoot. Only eight attacks anyway. That's fine. Just wait till I get into combat. You're gonna love my nerve. Yeah. Uh, what's their save? Uh, what defense? Yeah. Uh, -huh. uh they are defense five. Uh, their defense four actually, so take one damage. Mm -hmm. Do you know the funniest thing at the minute they can't? Is, oh, it's the ones in the trees, isn't it? Yeah. Yep. Then who's what's shooting next? Uh, the engineer, if he can. Um, he won't be able to. Okay. Uh, then that's it. Okay, so turn two. This is better fun than games, than it? Timmy! Can literally just make it through the forest. There's a tree in his way still. Oh. No, there's not. <laughs> <laughs> his arcs are still pretty good, though. Yeah. So, this is where it's going to get fun. Great. And no, it's the wrong bloody. No, please don't do that. Please do this. Oh, okay, they're out of range. That's not though. That's not though. That's technically out of range. That's fine. Hmm, I've got a thief now. Okay, so. These guys, so these guys here, are going to do a double move. But they're going to come up to here, and then they are going to pivot. These two are going to charge. So this one's going to charge right into here. So I now need to level get it lined up. Actually, no, they will. Can they get to the side? Yeah, they can get to the side. Cool. So they're going to charge to that section. Then they're going to charge into here. That would also hit into your stalwarts. Yeah, it's stalwarts. Just, it's just there's a tree in the way. These yep. guys are just going to. Can they charge in? No, I'd assume they'd be clipping no. any bit of the terrain, yeah, they would including the lake, which I would assume is impassable. Um, yeah, the lake would be classed as impassable. So they could technically clip it, but they would be more in the forest than anything. So, shooting! Could I have shooting? Um, right, what is my... Okay, so I'm going to do Lightning Bolt into these guys. Because I'm actually, who else is in range? Because Lightning Bolt's 24. Mm, yeah, I'll do it at your engineer. Why not? Actually, let me double check. So you've got 18 to 24, so it doesn't. Oh no, I've got it here. 24. Cool. Assuming I get a plus one due to you shooting oh, no, for a have, unit. No, I'd have to shoot them because I can't shoot past. Unless my height is different to your height. What's your height? I'd assume a three. What? No height two. Okay, I'm H2. Yeah, so I have to hit these guys with a lightning bolt. So it's four dice. Two hits. Uh, what's your defense? Five. Cool, so that will be fours. Oh, two damage. On the stalwarts, yeah. That's two damage. Right, nerve. 
They can't fail, can they? Nope. But we still got it because of yeah, cool. So they don't. Yeah, because I also forgot to do the other nerve test for your guys, but I don't think it would matter. No, and I, and you would have to re-roll it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Maybe. Yeah, no. Mm. Yeah, and then you would have had to re-roll it basically, and we'll just do the re-roll. Yeah, it would have made no difference. <laughs> so combat now. So who do we attack with first? They have the same stat line, but just different rules. So we're gonna do the legionnaires into the tank. Well, into your harvester. That's twelve dice. Yep. Hit in on threes. Sweet. Um, keep the dice at uh, three plus. No. So six, seven. Uh, what's your defense? Defense four, but I do have big shield, and I don't. But I can't find the rules on that. Um, big shield, big shield, big shield. I've got a rough idea what it does, but I'm not. It's the harvester, yeah. Yes. So I've got the book in front of me as well. Harvester, big shield. It doesn't say. Exactly, I've been looking for it, but I can't find it. I will find it, I think. It might just be something really simple. Uh, where's the half in this? Where does half in this? Okay. So there's a harvester, yeah? Yeah, huh? Well, I found another thing real quick. Uh, da -da, big shield. All attacks. Um, I'll treat uh, da -da -da, at the front. So it doesn't matter to them. They don't care. They're not hitting the front, they're hitting the side. So that's seven, and you're what, defense five? Uh, defense four. Oh, oh defense. Wait. Yeah, defense four. Okay, defense four. That's that's twos for me then, because I have crushing strength two. That's six. You damage. mean. Okay. They get crushing strength two. And my basic orcs have crushing strength one. <laughs> oh, six. Yeah, you take the harvester take six at the minute, and then your turn for a combat. Uh, I should. I'll swing with the stalwarts because it's twenty. Uh, it's twenty five attacks into the Riftforge legionaries. Mm -hmm. Are they both? Oh no, they're reborn legionaries. Yeah, reborns and I just noticed it's just standard warp boys and then black orcs. Huh. Yeah, huh? They're fighting through their trees. Uh, what's their defense? Five. Five. Uh, damage five. Hmm? Five damage. Nice. Uh, and then I'm going to put the Legionnaires. Uh, what's the defense of a Star Wars? Is it four? Five. Um, I'll throw the Legionnaires into this one. So that's 12. Keep three plus. No, threes. One, two, that's eight more damage. Done. Yeah. Uh, Obviously, to swing back. So he's already wavered. <laughs> uh huh. I need to roll a singular d6. That's three plus eight. So, 11, uh, with Brutal Crushing Strength and Thunderous Charge, but he didn't charge, so... so... you just get the plus one to damage, that's it. Swing. What is that roll? <laughs> You're keeping it. <laughs> That was brutal! <laughs> no, 
<laughs> no pun intended, but that was brutal. You literally have two hits on me. <laughs> and then you wound me on fours. Give me one second. I'm going to... You can't re-roll any of that. I'm going to cry, because he's got that... Revenous. No, not... he doesn't. He's got Ravenous, That's not Relentless. Yeah, Ravenous is a key word. It's, it's not has oh. no ability effect. It means Ravenous units can be affected. He can like Ravenous characters can affect him. So yeah, he literally generates no buffs from that. Um. Four. Uh, yeah, four up. You need into the same unit as well. It took five. Okay. So yeah, this thing's gone no matter what you roll. So yeah. roll away. Okay. <laughs> bye bye. Right, this is now going to be horrible because I can technically one unit can break. No, they both can. They both could break technically. Reroll. That's on my legionnaires, so they are fine. Yeah. Uh, next one. Reroll. They're good. Both times they would have broken. Yeah, if it wasn't for that reroll. I hate that reroll. They're, they're good. They're cushy. Uh, because they won co uh, combat, they can do a three inch move. So they are just going to. Not in the lake. <laughs> no, not. They are going to basically now lock. Um. You know what? They're just gonna move around and just lock, and just lock in even more. So they're gonna, but now lock into them. I that class is locked in. Yep, that would be. I've been looking at the. So if it falls within an inch, it basically no, it wouldn't be locked in. No. Um, so I'm gonna. Now let's see what the measurements are because it's, it's, under... it's... it's not even an inch. You locked it in there, but... I... They're locked in anyway from these guys, because of the charge. Yeah. Just the trees in the way. So, yeah, we just have to now rescuffle this combat a little bit. Because they're within an inch, like, right on the inch line. So... That's the one inch line. Drop it, drop it. Okay. Yeah. Because that is exactly an inch. Yeah. So I would say they are locked in. They're locked in anyway because of this one unit here that's just going to laugh. But they're locked in even more from the side now. Yeah. So. The annoying part is I can't just shoot into them. No, when you can't shoot these guys or these guys at the minute. No, I mean these legionnaires. Uh, the reborn guys. I. Turn. Can I shoot into the legionnaire? The reborn ones? They're in combat. <laughs> That's what I was saying. Yep. Because there are... Um, war engines, no. Special rules, no. I'm also going to double check the consolidate stuff. Melee phase, here we go. After combat. Uh... Oh! Oh, hang on a minute. No, that's different. After combat, target routed, charges regroup. And the enemy's coming. If your charger or counter is managed to route one enemy, it can do. Oh, hang on, I can do one of the following. Bear with me. Oh, that is horrible. That is horrible. Right, I need to redo that move. Because I have a, like, four. There are extra options. So instead of doing that, I am going to move D6 extra inches straight forward and I ignore all terrain for three so it's literally they were there so I need to move uh, they were exactly no. on the they were exactly on the three line yeah so technically yeah they would literally go in so it doesn't make any difference because they have to yeah the way they're just facing. down they're, they're literally yeah it made no difference <laughs> all right My turn. Yeah. Both the halfling rifle troop and the engineer is going to fire into Timmy. Yeah, I get. I'm in cover, so it's all good. 
<laughs> Leave Timmy I, alone. I doubt that's cover. You stood out in the open there. But I'm on the terrain feature. That's the catch. I know. That's the worst bit of that. No matter how much my head pokes out from around that tree, I'm still in terrain. Oh, by the way, he has he has defense five as well. <laughs> Don't care. Next game's what a thousand points scenario two. Yeah. Um. Your defense four. No, first one don't matter. Engineer with three attack. Have you got? Have you got any? Two. Yeah. So I take it. So one minus. damage. I'm gonna put it here outside of the tree. Yep. Uh, melee combat. They're out. I know that. They don't have enough distance. They're out of combat. Yeah, they're not even in combat. So we've got this combat here. So who do you want to hit? <laughs> The one that has the most damage so far. Okay. Cool. And then fives again. Or three. One, one two, three. So then my guys are going to swing. So. Yep. First unit. I'm happy with that. What's that mean? Three plus. <laughs> and then fours. So that's seven so far damage in total. And then that's their fives, aren't they? Yep. Okay, so that's another eight damage. No, nine, eight damage, yeah. They're gone, aren't they? <laughs> nope. Uh, right. Uh, nerf track. Do you want to... Oh, you got to do mine. So that's the Re -roll. first one. Reroll. Yeah. So that's for these guys. So they're gone. I believe they are. Uh, yep. How much damage do they have? Uh, 10. So that's yeah, 20. They're, yeah, they're gone. And then next one. Reroll. That's seven. They're good. Seven. Yeah. Your one. That's 19 oh, altogether. They're fine. So. Now it's. Ish. Yeah, no, they're fine. So, ha -ha. Uh, Fast off, these guys are going to charge. Yep. Predicted. These guys are going to charge. And they're going to charge. Like so. And then... Where's Timmy? There he is. Timmy! <laughs> uh, he's going to do his um, Thunderbolt. It's Thunderbolt uh, 4, I believe it is. Yep. So... Into what? Oh, it's going to go into the close... Uh, to basically... Oh, I can go into either, so I'll throw it into the rifles. It's the same distance, so okay. the rifles. Um da, 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 da. What's their defense? Uh defense four. Okay, so they take two damage. No, defense three. Yeah, they take uh, two damage. And then still take two. Then I need to do the roll for them. That's five, six, seven. They're good, aren't they? They're fine. So combat. You know what? Let's use. I'm not too worried at the minute. Let's do these guys over here into them. So that's twelve. Hit on threes. The ten. And then four plus. Uh, that's five six seven. They've got uh, so they take seven damage here. Yep. 
Uh, the very buggered up stalwarts are going to slap up the reborn legionaries. Actually, no. What's the defense of the uh, Thunderseers? Uh, five. The same defense. They're all defense five. Everything. Damn. Yep. Right into legionaries it is. Why legionaries? Because I would rather <laughs> kill the Black Hawk. And you mean the fact that my Thunderseers would benefit from the Inspiring Special Room? Yeah. 5.2 inches, so technically they would benefit from it. Uh, that is... 6 damage, please. Puts you on 7. Cool. Uh, my turn. We're going to do the Legionnaires, because why not? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'll have that. So, three, six, nine. And then threes for an additional five damage. Uh, yeah, they're shaken. At the minute, they're shaken. Unless you roll a double one. But even if you roll a double one, because the damage it would go over, they would. Unless I physically wipe them. Yeah. Uh, this is for the other unit. Yep. Five. That's five. Thunder says, smaller unit, but has bigger attacks. Um, what they hit on? They hit on fours, so it's not as scary. So that's just six. And that's two more damage. So that's just 22. Um, right, I'm going to roll your nerve checks. Uh, they're gone. Uh, first of all, those ones. How badly are they gone? That's a 30. Um, so they're gone. And then I I still have to roll over here for the other Star Wars. Double one. They're good. Ah! They're fe uh, I think they're, they're fearless, I think, yeah, now. I think they are. I'm pretty sure. Do you want to roll my ones? I'll double check the double one rule. Uh, this is your lower squad. That is seven... Plus six. Thirteen? Does that break um nope. the Reforge? Nope. 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 Do I have to reroll? Nope, because they're not within sixes. Okay. Uh Okay, double one holds your ground. Uh by result, it will always be steady regardless of any modifier. Okay. But enemy that has suffered enough to make this mouth still be devastated. Okay. So yeah. So they they don't suffer any modifiers now. They can't be restricted by any modifiers. Okay. Um, right now, we because I want combat here. Um, I'm going to do my Boudreaux floppies. Hold on. You said the reborn uh, the reborn legionnaires, right? They took damage, didn't they? Mm, yes. There you go. Uh, five, six, seven. 14. They're good. They're I'm chilling. Huh? I'm taking these dice. <laughs> uh, right, so this would be on the Thunder Seer Regiment. They get an extra six inches forward. There you go. And then these guys, I will just move sideways and they get how many inches? Because it's a wacky one. Melee phase. Yeah. For combat as well. Okay, cool. So I got to roll a D3 now for this one to move them sideways. Um, so one. For three. That then basically puts them in combat. Yep. So now I have to mess about with the facings. And because of the way the facing rule works. It would have to go like that. So they get locked in. That's quite hilarious isn't it? That unit's going to be a thorn in your side isn't it? No. Pretty much I've do i Looking over this fight, I've just been rolling terribly. Uh, right, so that's your turn three now. 
did you just have a turn or was that me? That was you, wasn't it? Believe so. Yeah, so turn four. Do, 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 do. Can they be Oh my god, they're so close, but no. Do, 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 do. do you want to move your token? Yep. Bunza! That's not gonna be nice for them, is it? Nope. And he's just gonna move up a little bit. Um Lightning bolt into your main dude, your character, because that's the only thing that can take pop shots. Okay, that's three dice. Two damage. Alright. And then... So he's taking two damage now. Um, right, nerve check. Oh, he was almost double one. Um, combat. I'm just going to do this combat here. So I will do 12. Yep. So that's eight. Eight go through. And then that's three more damage. Yep. Onto these guys here. Yep, move the damn thing. There we go. Uh, now which they will hit. I'll hit back with them. Is that just because they're prop? They will hopefully survive. That's um, fifteen. Winding on fives, eight. Yes, eight. So eight dice. You need to hope to Christ you get a double one. If you get a double one, you're not going to like what's going to happen. Oh, I know. All right, so I might as well just do these ones here. So, fast 12. Uh, four, five, seven. Uh, that's six damage so far. What are their defense three? Defense three. Uh, cool. That's an additional nine damage. Um. Oh no, they get they get to fight. Well, oh no, but they're dead. So I was just moving them. Okay, I was gonna say they're gone uh, no matter what I roll. Yeah, no matter what you roll, they are gone. <laughs> they're gone. That's not bad of a roll. No, it is. Oh, that's bad. <laughs> Defense fine, no matter what you hit. <laughs> um, so because combat was one, um, I'm going to move D3 sideways. Um, and then, right. Right, oh, now checks. Uh, let me quickly yeah. Move. So you're one. They're cushy. I no. They can't break. But, no, yours can't break. Oh. So they're fine. They're literally... You have to do more damage to them. <laughs> Otherwise, they are not moving. So... I think you've won this, because I can't come back from here. They move one. One inch. Man, I can't come back from this. So they're now locked him in place. They get two. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> come back from this manga that was, that was that was brutal that was terrible rolling on my part excellent rolling on your part so is it unit strength we go by you've won no matter what yeah no but is it unit strength we go by no it's by points you've won i lost 150 <laughs> points that's what i lost how many points did you lose uh, 190 plus 80 plus 140. Oh, yeah, that's a win. That is a win for the Reforge. Let's go. They hit Woo! like... They hit like trucks and you can't do no damage. They, yeah. <laughs> they literally hit like a freight train. <laughs> oh, so that is a Reforge 1 win for the first game. And so now we obviously need to... 
sort the next one out. Um, but yeah, so that's the that's that game over, people. Um, obviously, um, we will be sorting out game two, but that is Reforge one and Halfling zero. So we will see you on the next game in scenario two in Battle of the Woods.